Hello guys, welcome back to the Civil Engineering YouTube channel. Please subscribe our channel for daily civil engineering videos. In today's lecture, we are going to discuss the concept of mass, volume, and density. So I'm going to explain these terms with the help of an example, so it will be easy to understand and easy to follow. So we are going to start with the mass. Now, mass is very simple. It is basically the amount of matter contained in a substance. So it is the amount of material or matter amount of material contained in a substance so for example if i consider this is in a jar or in a um, square kind of material so when we pour the concrete here or maybe cement or maybe water and this is full of this material so what happened we basically have the mass of this material we call the amount of this material inside this object will be known as the mass how much its weight so mass can be represented as mass is basically represented in unit of kg or in grams these are the most common unit for the mass. We also have another units, for example, for example, milligram and so. But these are most commonly used in the civil engineering, kilograms and grams. So now the second terms is volume and mass is always, for example, if I put the concrete here and we, we put this mass into a machine and we measure that the mass is, for example, of this concrete is 800 kilogram so this will be the mass of this concrete in this object the second one is the volume now volume is basically the quantity of three-dimensional space enclosed by a closed surface so volume is basically the quantity of three dimensional space enclosed by a by a closed surface so how can i define the volume here it is basically the three dimensional space this is very important in terms of the volume so we see here this is in a concrete place here concrete material but now it is placed in a 3d object for example this is the length of the object l this is the width of the object and this is the height of the object so this three parameter will make the volume of the object so volume is basically is length into width into height of the object these three parameters will place an object together and this will be known as the volume of an object so when we pour the concrete in this object and we fill this object with the concrete material and let's suppose the length of this object is two meter the width is this one is one meter this is length is two meter and this height is for example three meter so one meter is the width and three meter is the height so we got here 6 meter, 6 cubic meter. So now the volume of this concrete is 6 cubic meter here in this object. So this is known as the volume of the material. The third is the density which is basically is the combination of the mass and volume. How? So I am going to define it here. The density is basically it is the mass of a unit volume density is basically can be defined as the mass of a unit volume so now what does this mean mass of a unit volume it means the quantity of mass contained in one volume in a unit volume means 
it is either one cubic meter or one cubic centimeter it should always be the mass of an object in one unit volume so this is very important to understand that it is the mass only in a unit volume not in other quantity so how i will define now this so for example i looked into the mass of this concrete into this object and let's suppose this is 800 kilogram so the mass of this object is mass is equal to 800 kilogram and the volume of this object was 6 cubic meter so that what will be the density the density is basically equal to the mass divided by the volume so when i divide the mass which is 800 kilogram dividing it by 6 cubic meter what we will get we will get 133.33 kilogram per cubic meter we see here that now it is per cubic meter it means that this amount of kg of mass is present in one kg in one cubic meter or in one yes here here the example is cubic meter so here this amount of mass is present in one cubic meter so i hope you guys understand that it is density is basically the mass of an object in cubic meter keep in mind in, in a unit volume in one not in terms of six or five or four so we divided the total the mass of the object divided by total volume so it means that its density is 133 kilogram per cubic meter it means if i explain it more if i consider this is one cubic meter object the same object about one about but with one cubic meter for example this is one this is one and this height is also one meter this all dimensions are one meter then how much of concrete can come into this place then only 1000 sorry 133 kilogram of 0.33 kilogram of concrete can come into this object so this is the density of this concrete material or of any material so density is basically the mass per unit volume i hope you guys understand and don't forget to subscribe our channel for daily civil engineering videos. Thank you for watching our video.